Turning now to the coronavirus pandemic, we could see the first COVID-19 vaccine for kids younger than six years old before the summer. Moderna is applying for emergency use authorization from the FDA, and Local 12's Kristen Cornett spoke with doctors at Cincinnati Children's Hospital about their data. Kristen? Good morning. Yeah, big news from Moderna yesterday. They are seeking that emergency use authorization for their vaccine. It's going to cover ages six months to six years. And this group right now has been the only one that hasn't had a vaccine option in the last couple years of the pandemic. And, you know, Cincinnati Children's has been involved in this study, as well as 11 total COVID-19 clinical trials. And you know, this one's a big one. This is one a lot of parents of young kids have been waiting waiting for. So here's what we know so far. I had a chance to review Moderna's press release they sent out yesterday, kind of detailing their study. And it says that this shot is for kids, like I said, six months to six. It's two shots right now, 28 days apart. That's what they were studying. And this is a trial that Dr. Robert Frank, he's the director of vaccine research with Cincinnati Children's, has been following closely, especially with the local trial, local parts of the trial that have been conducted here. And Moderna published results saying the vaccine was around 40% effective in preventing that symptomatic COVID amongst this age group. Now, this immune response is similar to that of Moderna's young adult vaccine group. And even though 40% may not sound like a lot, it's more about preventing that worst case scenario. While uh, serious infection in children is lower than adults, it's not zero, unfortunately had a number of children hospitalized, had a number of children that have died from COVID, um, much less likely than adults, but it's not zero. Right, and I had a chance to talk with Dr. Frank a little bit more about that too. And I asked him, you know, okay, so they took kind of the first step in getting this vaccine out there to the public with this application for the emergency use authorization. So right now he said it kind of gets reviewed by the FDA, all of the data. And I asked him about a time frame, and he said, guys, yeah, it would time out to be almost around right when summer would begin, about six to eight weeks from now that this review process would take place. And I also asked Dr. Frank about what kind of side effects they've seen for this age group. That's a huge question question that parents have when it comes to something a little unknown like this. And we'll talk more about that coming up in about 30 minutes. Thank you, Kristen. We'll continue to keep you updated on what the FDA decides on that on the air and online at local12.com.